given, that's how we live it. Don't be mad at the system, it's simply how we've existed. Pain is inevitable. How many of you know whether you're rich or poor, you can't avoid pain? Doesn't matter what nationality you are, you will have pain. Doesn't matter how old you are, doesn't matter how many cars you've got, you will have pain. No one can escape pain, but we can learn how to manage pain. Because pain is inevitable, but misery is optional. When life gets on top of you and you feel like it's all becoming too much, it's easy to let things spiral out of control. That place where you feel like the weight of the world is on your shoulders. Things don't go your way, that promotion at work you don't get, you don't make the team, your business is struggling, the bills are piling up. When this happens, the easy thing to do is just to roll over, to lie there and let life treat you like a little bitch, to hold your hands up and say, this is just the way life is. This is just what happens to me. These moments in life are always gonna be there. Don't think for one second there comes a stage in your life where this doesn't happen. But what you've got to start to do is to take back control of your life. Stop being a victim. Stop letting life push you around and start fighting back. Because the minute you tell yourself that you control this shit is the minute you can start to change it. It all starts the moment you take responsibility and say to yourself, I can make out of this life what the fuck I want. And no one and nothing is going to shape my destiny but me. You've got to stare all that shit in the face and say, you can't beat me, I'm too strong. It ain't going to be easy. Most of the time you're going to feel like there's no way out, that you can't do it. But listen to me when I say there is always hope. But you have to take control, attack it head on. Because as soon as you do this, just once, just like a muscle lifting weights, you become stronger. You become comfortable being uncomfortable. And before you know it, you become fucking untouchable from all that external bullshit that on a daily basis pops up to kick you in the teeth. You become a machine and nothing, nothing on the outside can affect you because your mind is trying to beat it down. Never run, always fight. The rewards in life don't always go to the biggest or the bravest or the cleverest. The rewards in life go to the dogged, to the determined, to the tenacious. Those who get back on their feet when they're kicked and they get up again and again. The rewards go to those who understand what it means to never give up. When you feel like quitting, remember all of those who said you'd fail. When you feel like giving up, remember why you started. When you feel like quitting, remember what you're doing it all for. When you feel like quitting, remember pain is temporary and greatness lasts forever. When you feel like quitting, remember that the pain you feel today will be replaced with the strength you need tomorrow. Remember that every ounce of pain you feel is building a stronger you, a stronger body, a stronger mind, and a stronger character. So push through the pain. Don't let it stop you. Force it to grow you. Don't back down from the pain. Face it. Feel no pain. There is no pain. That painful last rip, that's nothing. Give me more. Push harder. Too tired. Too hard. Too busy. Too early. Too stressed. No excuses. Too tired. No excuses. Too hard. No excuses. Too busy. No excuses. Too early. No excuses. Too stressed. No excuses. When I feel like quitting, I remember there's too many people I need to prove wrong. When I feel like quitting, I remember I have too much to fight for. I will not quit. Sleep in, death for grandma. I'm up, I'm ready to go. Quitting, that's for those who have no heart. I do not quit. Your greatest physique, your greatest health, your greatest strength, it doesn't come with average effort. If you want average results, keep showing up and giving average effort. 
If you want to be at your best, you will have to give your best effort. Make an oath to yourself that you will not walk out of any training session, any game, anything without giving 110% of your soul. Whatever you think is your limit, push past it. Whatever you think is your max, see if you can get 10% more out. Results don't lie. It all comes down to one simple question. How bad do you want it? And when you feel like quitting, give me 10 more. Nothing great is going to come if you quit. I know it's hard. I know you are tired. I know it seems impossible, but you must keep going. Stick it out and get your reward. Given that's how we live it, don't be mad at the system, it's simply how we